One minute, you're 17, going to the first day of a degree you barely know about, and the next minute, you're 23, shopping for the shoes you're going to wear to your graduation. And then I get to be like that tata. I was looking for white shoes, going for kind of a pink and white vibe, and there were a lot of options, but some of them were a little too much like going on for me. And the bow ones that I almost ended up with they didn't even have a size for me, so I had to let them go. But yeah, worry not because everything comes together in the end, and I'll show you guys in the whole. Hi guys, I'm Antonia. Welcome to my channel. If you've never seen this face before, never heard the voice, but especially have never heard the name, this is she. Yes, I am. And I am graduating. <laughs> It is now the 26th of March and I'm graduating on the 28th. So it is two days away and I'm so, so, so excited. This is my second graduation. Uh, I graduated in 2020, was it two, 2022 uh, for my BCom degree. And that was really fun. I didn't really focus too much on my graduation that year because it was the same year as my 21st. And since I had a big 21st celebration, that's where my time and money went. And me being a March baby, it means my birthday is around graduation season at Vids. So Vela Vela, my grad and my birthday are always close together. So that year I prioritized my birthday, turning 21 and everything, and I don't have any regrets about it. But this year, baby, this year is all about the degrees. And yes, you heard me. I said degrees, your baby is about to be too belted. Hey, please, I'm so excited. It has been a little bit stressful, but um, obviously it's a little stressful. It's planning, like planning in general is really stressful. But yeah, I am so excited. I'm just taking it all in and I cannot believe that five years at Vids has resulted in my two degrees. I have learned so much in my time there. I grew so much. I met the best people I, that I'm taking with me for the rest of my life. I would not trade those five years for anything. And every experience, every person, every heartbreak, every test, every tear, all the pain, all the stress, all the sleepless nights, they have all accumulated to these little moments like these ones when we get to celebrate. And I really cannot wait. Ah, yeah. So um obviously i'm excited obviously i'm excited as you can tell but let me catch you guys up on what has been happening the first thing let's talk about outfit so i have a suit that i got from mr price my mom bought it for me last year it was during that barbie whole thing and everyone was doing pink and mr price had these nice pink suits my mom saw it liked it for me and bought it for me but i never wore it like i never had an occasion to wear a pink suit and she did say and you know what here i am so i'm very happy that the outfit part is out for my first graduation i wore a dress really cute so i definitely knew that i didn't want a dress this time around i knew that i wanted a suit you know i just want to feel like legally blonde vibes <laughs> even though i'm not gonna be blonde and yeah I just wanted the legally blonde vibes. I just wanted to feel all professional. I actually love, I think that's the most classic, simple, sophisticated, most classic, basically the most classic type of graduation outfit is a nice two piece suit. So I have that from Mr. Price, but I went to get it tailored. I'm 
I'm currently in Pretoria North to get my jacket tailored. Yeah, I want it to kind of be a cropped vibe. And I don't think I even showed you guys what it looks like when it's long. But yeah, it was like a normal sized jacket. And I just want it to be cropped for the look. Um, I actually am having the laziest day ever. Like I was supposed to undo my hair today, which... I will do only later then, which means I'm only gonna wash my hair later, which means which is something that I usually don't like, but yeah, everything's just happening so fast because I let it go because I was lazy today, but yeah, let's go get my jacket tailored and I'm hoping that he can finish it at least tomorrow so that if there's anything that went wrong with it, then we can have it fixed before Wednesday, before Thursday. the top and the shoes i went to maravastad i love maravastad if you're from pretoria and you don't shop go maravastad you are playing yourself <laughs> because sheen these insta boutiques basically it's all maravastad let's do a haul of the stuff i bought from maravastad for my grand okay so i bought a top um I actually wanted to buy a corset top from Sheen for graduation and then I just didn't. So I was like, I'm gonna look for a corset top. And I didn't want the typical one. I wanted a white one. I didn't want the typical one that I've seen everywhere. So I found this corset and I really, really like it. Like, I don't know, like it's giving granny design a little bit. Like this is giving a bit granny design, but it has real boning inside and yeah it's just very nice it's, it's really giving like ancient corset types like it really looks like medieval times corsets but i really like how it looks with the suit and i also love that i'm definitely gonna be wearing this corset for vibes after grad like this is definitely coming into the collection of my clothing i've always wanted a corset so i'm very happy that i got it it's really cute I think I showed you guys this though in the try on because I took a video when I was trying it on. And then the shoes, Sana. The shoes came in this really pretty box. And yeah, I looked around for shoes, y'all, because there were a lot of options, but a lot of them were very dressy. Like they were very eventy. You gotta, I'm getting married, or it's my matric dance or something, you know, and they were not very wearable like beyond the event but these ones caught my eye the moment we walked in and these are one of the first ones i saw it's one of the first ones i tried on i absolutely love the butterflies i think they're so pretty and i love this base because it makes it more comfortable to walk in don't mind that red bottom don't worry about that <laughs> but yeah these are so pretty you guys like tell me these are not the prettiest heels ever i'm so 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 excited they're super super comfortable to walk in so i'm very happy about that and yeah this design is so pretty and these are definitely like you can tell they're special for something like when i'm going to be dressed in the ensemble it's going to be so cute and special but i can also wear them outside of the special occasion when i just want a cute white heel right like so now it's just a cute white heel that i have i absolutely love these and yeah like i said they're really comfortable to walk in so i know that i'm going to be good on the day and yeah i'm just really excited like Yay, these are so pretty. Good morning, it's my grad day. <laughs> I just did my hair and now I'm going to my makeup appointment. So let's go. It's eating, it's eating. Palisa ate on the face. I am. I'm so ready to get the outfit on now. I actually am now doing my nails because I did not have glue. So I quickly ran and went and bought glue. So now we're doing the press on nails. The outfit is next and then we're going to be done. Yo, I'm so excited. <laughs> Good 
This day was so chaotic and went by so fast. My phone even died during the day. But I hope you guys enjoy some of the beautiful moments that were captured on this lovely celebration day. Tane Mokhlala.
Hey y'all, oh my gosh, it has been a long day. I cannot begin to explain how long of a day it has been. I I, I think you can imagine. I, I don't even know if I should unpack the whole day while I, I'm still this gorgeous. <laughs> while I'm still this gorgeous. But yeah, why, why not, why not, why not? So first of all, I was running around like a headless chicken <laughs> only because we were late just a smidge but we actually ended up being exactly on time which you know for these kind of events means that you're late because you needed to be in there and relaxed and that was not the case like we were rushing on the freeway like crazy people and it was mainly because I wanted to make it in time to be part of the choir performance so that meant that I had to be like, I had to get my, 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 my gown and the, the belts like before time, way before time so that I can meet the choir so that I can go in with them. So I was in a hurry to make sure that that is done. And oh my gosh, I ended up being right on time. And you know, the loads are never exactly on time. So luckily it's like, it was like five minutes, just 10 minutes, you know, extra way I could finish all my stuff and yeah then i sang with the choir which i'm very very excited about that might be that just might be the highlight of a very long time like i really loved it i enjoyed it but i'm definitely going to search up the video on youtube and put it here for you guys because there's no way you guys are not gonna see that like i want to have that video video but since I can't frame it, I'm gonna have that video in my favorites. I'm gonna post it somewhere. I'm gonna post it here for you guys. I need everyone to see that video. Um, yeah, I'm very happy I got to perform with the choir. I'm so happy. I'm so proud. Like, oh, that after I got to sing, I sat down with all the other LLB graduate baddies. It was just so good also seeing everybody that I went to school with for four fucking years. Some of them five. Like, some people we both did we all did become law and llp so we've been together since 2019 bro like some people i stepped in with them and there they were crossing the stage it was just it was beyond like just being proud of myself i was just proud of us like i was just proud like it was such a yo i was like it was so crazy to me to think about that not only did I go on my journey, which I'm very happy I documented so much of my varsity life for you guys, for me, for you guys, just, I'm so happy that I found YouTube and I found filming and content creation because I literally have videos of me in the library, me in class, just a regular day when I could, I could only dream of this day. So I, I'm just happy that I have that documented to know that those people that I was in class with, at some point we helped each other. At some point we were in a group together. At some point you helped someone who helped me. Like at some point we, we were consulting clients together and to think how we were all at one point just newbies at vids and there we were crossing the stage today. It was just incredible. Like I, <laughs> I <laughs> and then, okay, okay. And then singing, then I crossed the stage. I'm sure I inserted that. You all saw that already. I crossed the stage. It was absolutely lovely. I, yeah, I've done it before, but this time felt real. Like the first time it was after COVID, uh, we were still on the grass. We were not in the great hall. I had a test in two days after my graduation. So it was a fun that was so short lived. It was stressful and I knew that there was stress after. So this time, like, I don't know, like crossing there and thinking about like, what if I never study at Vits again? Like, what if I decide I'm never going to study and this was it. This was my graduation. Like, this is the one. Like, yeah, I, I can't even contain my excitement. I'm just so happy. Like, I'm so happy. I'm so proud. I, I don't think I've ever been proud of myself. Like, I've had many moments in my life where I'm like, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. But today, this, this, this double degreed Han, this double degreed lady did that like i have two degrees from one of the most prestigious universities in south africa africa 
and I did it at 23 in record time. Nah, that's mad. Like I, I almost lost my sanity, but I didn't. Whew. Yeah, I just, as you can see right now, Kisala dolled up because something in me refuses to take my makeup off. Like this makeup eats. Like if I ever get to this level of being able to do my own face, I get like it's okay, Jill. Lisa artistry is the truth. Like, and I realized I didn't vlog when I went to her. Honestly, in the morning, I was just excited. I was just like, next on a honey pee. They're like, you know, they get to kill for you. So I did not vlog her and her and the process of everything, but it was just beautiful. We just talked a little. Um, she's really cool. She's really cool. She's awesome. She's she's awesome, and yeah. But anyway, Lisa Artistry is the plug if you guys want this kind of face. And you 100% do want this kind of face. So you better go check her out. Like, I'm not even asking anymore. Or you want this kind of face. <laughs> but anyway, like, yeah, I crossed the stage. I crossed the stage. I sat down next to one of my classmates. We talked about how crazy this is. No, I don't have a major. I have a degree. Maybe I have two. <laughs> And I'm just so happy because in this world, no one can ever take that away from me. Like, you know, like it's my degree. I'm, it's not anyone else's degree. It's mine. Like they're both mine. They're in my name that I worked for, that I earned, that I got and I celebrated. And my loved ones celebrated with me too, which ugh, guys, I'm so loved. Like, oh, oh like, oh, I don't even know what to say. Like, I'm just a little overwhelmed. We've been home for a few hours. I'm starving. It's a pizza. But I don't know if I should just take this, maybe vlog, close it off here and go wash my face and just sit in my pride, like the pride I have about what I just achieved. Or if like I should take more pictures. I'm leaning towards take more pictures because I feel like this face needs to be seen oh, oh oh speaking of which i'm not even there like i keep jumping around the story i crossed the stage my loved ones were there my mom my dad and my little sister were in the hall with me which was absolutely lovely um and then my friends came out to see me my man came out to see me i got these oh my god y'all the prettiest Yo, look at these. These are beautiful. These ones are from Rati. These ones are from my me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're just stunning. I just, like, like, tell me these flowers and my face aren't, like, the highlight of your day right now. Like, this has to be the highlight of your day. <laughs> anyway, you can tell I'm hella excited. You can tell I'm hella I don't think I talk this much ever on this app. Like, I don't think I've ever recorded for freaking nine minutes now. But yeah, I am so filled with gratitude. I just, yeah, I just, I'm thankful to the people along the way who were giving us notes. I'm thankful to my clinic partner, Dimpo. Like, I would not have made it without her. Like, yo, I would not have made it without my friends at Viz. I, I literally walked in there 17 years old. Here I am at 23, two degrees later, learned so much, made the best friends I'll ever make in my life. The memories are like, like, I, yeah. When I think of my early 20s, when I think of varsity, I'm going to think of it. I'm going to think of my time here. And that's something I'll never, ever forget. Like, I am so happy. And I, I, I know, I know, contrary to popular belief, I went out. I made choices that I 100% regret. I made choices that I will 100% make again. I, I, I jolled. I friendshiped. I saw some things. <sighs> I can't believe it's over. 
I can't believe it's over. And now I'm waiting on the professional photos because a photographer was present. A photographer was present. I had to make sure this time. I had to make sure I want pictures for life. I want these that I'm going to frame for the rest of my life. I want a LinkedIn photo. Like... Mm. and the way dealing i'm gonna plug y'all with the photographer too because like everything came out today like i genuinely had a perfect day like i had a perfect day yo yeah <laughs> thank you guys so 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 much for watching i will catch you guys in the next video i don't know if it's gonna be this exciting because you only graduate well i guess twice Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, my lovies. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I won't look this pretty. I won't be. I won't be this in the next video. But it'll be worth it regardless. <laughs>